we have to find critical numbers of a given function. A critical number of function is a number which belongs to domain of our function and the first derivative for this number is equal to zero or first derivative of this number does not exist. So first we need to find the domain. Because we have fraction, it means we have to check when the denominator will be zero. So we have t squared minus 2t plus 4 is equal to 0. To solve this equation, we will use quadratic formula. So t1, 2 is equal minus b plus minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. We know that the coefficient before t square is our a, so a in our case is equal 1. Coefficient before t is b, so in our case b is equal negative 2. And the constant is, is our c, so c is equal 4. So now we will replace we have negative, in parentheses we will have negative 2 plus minus square root of negative 2 to second power minus 4 times a is equal 1 times c, c is equal 4 over 2 times 1. So this is equal, we have 4 plus minus square root of 4 minus 16 is equal negative 12 over 2. Because we got negative number under square root, it means our equation doesn't have real solution. So the domain for this S function will be all real numbers. Let me write this. S is all real numbers. Now we have to find first derivative. So S prime of T is equal because we have division here we will use quotient rule. Let me write this maybe here in this corner. We have u over v derivative is equal v times derivative of u minus u times derivative of v over v square. In our case, u is equal to let me write this. And v is equal t square minus 2t plus 4. So we have in numerator, we just copy first denominator. So we have t square minus 2t plus 4 times derivative of the derivative of constant is 0, so it's times 0 minus we have now 2 times derivative of denominator, so it's 2t minus 2 over t square minus 2t plus 4 to second power. This is equal. We have First part, 0 times this whole expression will be 0, so we have negative 2 times 2t is negative 4t. Negative 2 times negative 2 is plus 4 over t squared minus 2t plus 4 to second power. So we have derivative of our function as now we need to check the domain of our derivative. 
we have the same denominator like before. So the domain for our derivative will be the same like the domain for our S function or real numbers because the denominator will never be zero because we, we don't have real solution for this quadratic equation. So let me write this domain. S prime is all real numbers. It means we don't have critical numbers. Now we have to set our first derivative equals zero if and only if we have negative 4t plus 4 over t squared minus 2t plus 4 to second power is equal to 0. This whole left side will be equal 0 only when numerator will be 0 because the numerator cannot be 0. So we have to solve just linear equation negative 4t plus 4 is equal 0. I will move 4 to the right side. So we have negative 4t is equal negative 4. Now we divide both sides by negative 4. Negative 4 will reduce. So we have t is equal 1. We have one solution for this equation. Now we have to check if this number belongs to domain of our function. The domain of S function is all real numbers. So t equals 1 belongs to domain. So it means we have one critical number. t equals 1.